Good, good evening, my Dolly friends. Happy Friday. Yay, the weekend is here. If you are off work, I hope you got home safely. This is Gina with Little Midwest Reborns and Dolls. And I am here today. I am doing a trifecta of themes. In other words, I'm doing three different themes today. Now, one of them is going to be Thankful Friday, which is brought to us by Tammy over at Tater Tots Nursery. And today I am very thankful for the fact that I am 60 years old and my parents are still living. Um, and my father is still here. And that Sunday I will be going over to um, my parents' home and we will be celebrating Father's Day with my dad. So I'm extremely thankful and grateful for that because I know many, I have many friends that are my age that both of their parents are gone. So I'm extremely thankful for that. Um, and blessed. And I want to tell you that right in front of you, I have my beautiful Stephanie Renee. Hello, aunties. Hello, uncles. Mommy's going to put me in something pretty. So, and she will be participating in Floral Friday, which is brought to us by Melissa at Let's Play Dolls. And this is what I'm going to put her in. It is a Wonder Nation 0 to 3 little sleeper. So she will be getting in that. I will be placing her in it. And then you notice that my Sterling Alexander here is in a monkey sleeper. This is from Little Me. It is preemie. And he's holding his little monkey, Mickey, Mickey the monkey. And, guys, not only does he have a monkey on the top of his sleeper, but look at how cute the feet are. He even has monkey little faces on the feet to his sleeper. But, and the third topic has to do with Sterling, which Sterling is actually the Elijah sculpt. And he was uh, brought to life by Samantha Ewing over at uh, My Royal Nursery. And she is on Reborns.com. And then my Stephanie Renee is actually the Vivian Sculpt by Sandy Faber. And her sweet little face was brought to life by Sherry Hawkins um, over at So Lovely Creations. She's on Facebook. And um, yeah. So that's, those are my two beautiful babies. And uh, I'm just getting them changed and close together. And I just wanted to uh, put that on. But Sterling, the reason Sterling is participating in this is because on Thursday, I wanted to do dress up thursday which is brought to us by in love and love with reborns 2011 by stephanie and jackie and what happened is i ran out of time and i wasn't able to do it so because I couldn't do it that day, I'm doing it today. And so I could easily say, well, I'm a day late and a dollar short. However, the truth is I'm a day late and probably two dollars short due to inflation. <laughs> but anyway, I hope, and, and their theme for Dress Up Thursday this week was either vintage or your favorite sleeper. And the sleeper that I have put Sterling in is one of my most favorite sleepers that I have. 
So that's why he's wearing it. And I will admit to the fact that actually I could have done vintage. Here's the thing. I kept one Rubbermaid box with a nice tight lid when my children had outgrown their baby clothes and then they were way too big for the like crib blankets and that. I packed all that stuff up and I probably packed all of that up in about 2000 and my daughter had been born in 19 January of 1988 and my son was born in July of 1989. So when I was getting ready to move in 2000, I packed all those things up and I decided to donate a lot of my newborn clothes and things. And what I did is I kept like two or three, maybe four of my most favorite outfits from my daughter and my son. And I did the same thing with quilts and blankets and like a bed sheet um, that I just absolutely loved and adored and always hoped that maybe someday one of my, if I ever had grandchildren, one of my grandchildren would wear it. Well, long story short, they are still sitting um, in the two tubs. One has their baby clothes in it and that's has tissue around it and bubble wrap around it and it's inside the Rubbermaid container. And then I did the exact same with the blankets and the one sheet. I think I kept one of their sheets. Um, it was a flannel sheet that kind of had a, I think a bluish gray background and had little bunnies all over it. And I loved it for winter time. Anyway, that's in a separate Tupperware a Rubbermaid, excuse me, not Tupperware, Rubbermaid tub. And it too has wrapped in tissue and then bubble wrap around it and then sealed in the tub. But it is 2023 now. And I was too lazy to get on a ladder. Plus I ran out of time to get it done. To, to pull a tub down, get the clothes out, get them washed. And then I could have done vintage on one of my boys. So I am going to make an effort to get a couple of those outfits out that will fit my dolls. Um, I have to go through it anyway. And I have a couple things I need to wash. So I will, you know, some baby clothes I need to wash. And when I do the baby clothes, I just, I do the baby clothes only. I don't wash them with my regular laundry. So yeah, I need to do that. But anyway... Stephanie and Jackie, Little Sterling is in one of my most favorite sleepers. It was from Little Me. It is a preemie size, and it's the blue one with the monkey, and that is my contribution to Dress Up Thursday, and then we still have Stephanie Renee in her beautiful floral sleeper for Floral Friday. Okay, guys. That's about it. I do have one more thing for you before I go. Did you know that in Hawaii, it is actually illegal to laugh very loudly? They only permit a low ha. Have a wonderful weekend, everyone. Remember that God loves you and he's always there for you. Bye-bye, my dolly friends. Take care.